Duke opening the 2013 season with North Carolina Central. Anthony Boone now in charge of the offense. Sean Renfrey's gone. First quarter, Boone is actually a wide receiver. Brandon Kinnett to Braxton Deaver for the three-yard touchdown. You know the phantom. You have to watch out for him when he's playing quarterback. Duke leads 7-0. North Carolina Central punting. Jamison Crowder, you know, he's number 23 on our ACC top 25 players to watch list. And there he goes. 76 yards, his first career return for a touchdown, but he has led Duke in all-purpose yards the last two years. 14-0 Blue Devils. Midway through the second. Boone. Over to Anthony Nash. Fumbles. North Carolina Central picks it up and takes it into the end zone. But wait. Take another look. The ruling is that Nash never had possession. So Duke keeps the football. No points on the board. And two plays later, Boone recovers from the rough snap and goes deep to Ryan Smith. 39-yard completion. Boone, a great start to the year. 16 of 20, 176 yards, keeps the drive alive. He would eventually score it on a one-yard run to make it 28-0. Then in the third, Connett to Isaac Blakeney, a 19-yard score. 42-0 Duke, the final 45-0. The first shutout for Duke since Steve Spurrier's Blue Devils did it to North Carolina, 41-0 in 1989. It's the first shutout in an opener for Duke since 1960 against South Carolina, and the first time they've won back-to-back -back openers since 1987 and 1988. Next up for the Blue Devils at Memphis.